All right. Where are we? That one. Hey! Good evening, good evening, good evening. How's everybody doing? Happy Monday. First day of the week. If you worked today or you had uni today, hopefully it went well. Hopefully we're off to a good start. Uh, and if we're not off to a good start, hopefully tonight can make it a little bit better for tomorrow. And you only got four days left until Friday. And then a Jason video comes out. And then that makes the whole weekend worth uh, looking forward to. Is that? No, oh, I made that sound bad, didn't I? Nah, damn it. Oh, well. <laughs> um, who watched last week's video? Challenge accepted. What was last week's? The gun game. Uh, redacted game. Can't write guns in uh, in YouTube titles. Uh, Wally was back. Look, there's Wally here. Wally's going to sit quietly during the stream. Because if he doesn't, he's not going to come back into this week's video. We laugh. We laugh. We laugh and we play. Um, I'm playing some uh, Harry Potter um, tonight. Hogwarts Legacy, the new game uh, that's out on uh, PCs and also the new newer consoles. Hey, David's in. Uh, yeah, so you have to either have a PC, which I have a Mac, or you have to have one of the new consoles, Ooh, which my bank account's not very happy about. Uh, <laughs> but... It's Catherine's fault. She twisted my arm. She said it's a business expense. I don't know if, if that's true. David, I might need your um, your tax knowledge on that. <laughs> Can I claim it? <laughs> um, <laughs> anyway, um, I've already started the game. Obviously, like I started playing it yesterday. Um, but I think that's okay because anyone that wants to play it themselves, it means I'm not spoiling the start of the game. You can still do your... Hogwarts sorting house stuff. You can still get your wand and everything like that without any spoilies. So I'm I'm already like a little bit into the game, but I'm not like crazy far. Um, I don't have a broomstick or anything yet. I don't even know when you get the broomstick. Uh, make an appointment. <laughs> Major rates. Hey, I I give you a, a family do di- <laughs> do accountants have family discounts? <laughs> um. Uh. Yeah, I don't I don't know how far in you have to be to, in order to get the broomstick and f- be able to fly around. I might get it during this stream. Um, I don't know. Hopefully, yeah, I'm able to get it within the next 20 minutes or 30 minutes. I don't know. We'll go till we're bored. <laughs> don't know me too much, though. I'm not, I'm not sure what your hourly wage is, but it's, um, I feel like your hourly wage, what, what you would charge me is... Um, Probably still more than what I've saved you. <laughs> All right. Uh, Catherine is here. She's not on the microphone, but she's sitting just beyond the microphone. Uh, look, there's a hand. <laughs> she's a bit camera shy and microphone shy. But we can just turn it. No, I won't do that. Oh, I did turn it a little bit though. <laughs> oh, look, new new area as well. It's not the same as last week. It's not all messy like last week. Oh, right, let's get into the game. Um, so this is our character. So in the game, you start uh, as a fifth year at Hogwarts. Um, that's not a spoiler because you figure that out as soon as the game starts. Uh, you you would if you were going to buy the game, you would probably already know that as well. Um, and it's explained that you didn't have magic, and then it came out. Uh, I don't want to don't, don't want to bore you with it. Um, so anyway, this is our character here. You get to change your clothes, and you find new clothes, and they have like. Uh, power ups essentially your armor rankings better defense better offense and blah 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 blah. <gasps> look over there there's Hogwarts Ooh. the mission I'm doing is over here uh, at a at like a they call it a, a town but it's two houses um, but yeah well hopefully this mission won't take too long and we'll be able to come back and uh, explore Hogwarts a bit I've already done quite a bit of exploring. It's pretty cool. I can't wait till I get a broomstick because then I could uh, do more in-depth and more efficient exploring. Like the Quidditch pitch. All right. Um, Our character's name is Edward Taylor uh, because it's my middle name and last name. I was going to just go Jason Taylor because that's what I do in games. Uh, But I looked up most common names in uh, the 1890s, which is when this is set. Oh, Oh, <laughs> I don't know what, oh, someone's posted it in the chat. What house am I in? Catherine, you know what house I'm in. <laughs> you live with me. Um, so I'm Slytherin House. 
Uh, you see the snake there in the thing there. Slytherin house. The the only house to be in. Um, but I'm wearing all blue clothes. <laughs> well, that looks kind of green in this light, I think. Um, now I've lost my train of thought. God damn it. Uh, what was I saying? You have no idea, do you? You weren't even listening. You had your own agenda. Damn it, Wally. You should know where I'm up to. You have role you have a role to play in this. Um what was I saying? I got no idea what I was saying. Anyway, um this is one of our friends, um, Natsai Onai. But we call we just call her Natty. That her nickname's Natty. Um she is one of our um Michael's in the chat. Uh she's one of our friends that we've made, uh, and she's helping us um do something. <laughs> I can't remember what, what we're doing, but we'll figure it out. Don't boost, Slytherin. Yes, already making him laugh and smile. Ren, Ren, Rock, Rookwood, and Harlow are the bad, bad guys in the game. There's an evil goblin and a couple of evil wizards. Um, we're not speaking about time. Ah. Uh, there's there's some uh like secret missions that you do at the start that you're not supposed to tell the other or anyone else about um that you you've been doing with one of the professors that sounds bad um yeah you and a and a professor go off and do secret missions that you can't tell people about uh <laughs> and uh, so I've been trying to stay with that sort of character and like and saying like ah I can't say and um. Even though all the friends are like, oh, oh, I heard something about a dragon. A dragon attacked you. And um, yeah, Kane, you get 10 points for tuning in. You, all you guys get 10 points for your house. So uh, if you want to if you want to chat what your Hogwarts house is, <laughs> this is how you get um, more viewership and more engagement. Um, we'll be making money in no time, Catherine. We'll be rich. We'll be rich. This empty cabinet will be filled with money. Oh, I don't have game audio in. Oh, I wanted to oh. speak to you. Sorry, guys. I realized something that day in Hogsmeade. You displayed such courage fighting. I was about to say you got to tell me if the audio is right. Was wasn't even on. one bit by Rookwood and Harlow. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood um, and Harlow are the Natty my is Natty. Who is this character it. again? I am not Where is she from? Wag Wagadu. Them destroy my new home. Something like that in Africa. I'm not going to sit by and watch him destroy my new home. I didn't listen to the rest of the conversation. I was too busy focusing over here. Um, Catherine, you picked up your phone when I said enter something, but you haven't entered anything. God damn it. Uh, I'm not going to sit by and destroy my home. This could be dangerous. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair on their own. And the fact that they're working with Ranrock... Ranrock is an evil goblin. I think I said that before. Be <laughs> Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations, taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. Officer Singer is an polite, aura or a um, wizard cop. Would not discuss details with a student. Easy way. Mark. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a Rookwood, massive bad guy. operation that Harlow is planning. Harlow, bad guy. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit. Try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. Right. Officer Singer, but wizard cop. Catherine's in Gryffindor. Alyssa More like Gryffin Snore. Am I right, Kane? Gryffin Snore. Get some, get some W's and Poggles in for that. I am here if you need me. Griffin Snore. You, nice. I don't think there's ever been a better Harry Potter pun. I beg your pardon. Oh. You Who's talking? What's going on here? Oh, over there. The girl from Uwagadu. <gasps> to the tent. So did she make me walk all the way down here in the middle of the night? Just to chat, and then now she's buggered off. And then just by coincidence, there just happens to be another mission down here. Let's go check out this tent. This is not Hagrid's tent. Again, this is the 1890s, 100 years before Harry Potter. 
What's going on here? I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to. Victor Rookwood don't give a doc's his nip. Ash Wonder Scout. Oi! Speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student, you can't be sick. <laughs> Leave her alone. Stupefy. Yeah, stupefy their butts. Hiya, 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 hiya. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm doing magic. I'm doing magic. So the combat mechanism, damn it, is it's pretty good. I'm just not very good at it. Let's catch him on fire. Send him on fire again. Oh, that is. <gasps> this one is bad guys. It's oh, not who I thought it was. The bad guy wears a top hat. The collection section of your field guide has been updated with a new enemy type. You may learn valuable insights on enemies such as their weaknesses to certain spells. Ooh. I'm going to throw a rock at you. Potato and stupefy. Oh! Bring your butt here. Set you on fire. I'm gonna attack you. I want this thing. Throw a rocket, you. Yeah. I just killed three dudes. <laughs> Five dudes, I guess. Oh! I've never been accosted in such a manner. Been so close to Hogwarts. Yeah. I agree. Did they drop anything for me? So that kind of went a bit fast. I'll, uh, I'll in a sec. I'll do like a breakdown of how the spells and stuff work. Are you all right? I am. Thanks in no small part to. I got no idea who this lady is. Defensive skills. Care to I don't tell think me why you Ashwinders no. were ready to dispatch me? I also haven't heard the word Ashwinder yet. Ashwinders. Victor Rockwood okay. sees <laughs> and extorts <laughs> his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. Um, I don't want to really ask either of these things. Research how interesting or who is Priya? I, don't, I honestly don't care. You're a researcher. <laughs> Nora Treadwell at your service. Fantastic. Historian and archaeologist specializing in Merlin's work and life. Do you like my um three scratches over my eye? My 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 story is that I got attacked by a werewolf and that's how um I discovered my magical ability at the age of uh fifth year. Was that 15, 15, 15 16? Um but but that's not what happens in the game. That's that's just Pure Jason um, imagination. Like a two-year-old. Quite advanced for a two-year-old, though. How extraordinary! Of the legend of King Arthur. That's not what I the said. The very same. <laughs> Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know. <gasps> and I'm studying some curious Merlin's fixtures beard. he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. Ooh. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. Classic I've video game thing where they put in random structures in the world and you're like, what is this? <laughs> and then eventually you get told what they are and they have some sort of meaning. Seems a bit tedious. I'm not sure old vine-covered pillars are worth studying. Well, I think anything concerning Merlin is worth pursuing, and I shall have you know. No okay, one Boomer. Has yet managed to figure out Am I right? Am I right, Kane? But I believe I Kane. just unlocked a crucial... Kane, you've gone a bit quiet. Kane. ...that Mallow Sweet is an important... Kane, are you there? ...in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet. Kane's left. Everyone's Versatile left. Her. Oh, everyone has Merlin left. repeatedly <laughs> mentioned it in his writings. <laughs> I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the center. That started me thinking, what if the Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols? Precisely. I've missed something. Would what the heck is a Mallow Suite? Honors, we can see what comes of our little hypothesis. 
See how I roll there? I brought a trunk chock full of Crazy I roll at the end. It's just over there by my tent. A, a mallow sweet. Is that like a marshmallow? This trunk. Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I have the mallow sweet. Lovely. Oh, it's leaves. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. As well Each as the stone... That? The, the stone swell. Sweet on the swell. And we'll see what happens. Place the mallow sweet. Okay. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> see that? The vines disappeared. <gasps> what should I do now? Whoa. Let's light him on fire. No. Attack him. Solve Merlin's trial. Yeah, I knew it. I learned the fire spell pretty recently, so I'm assuming uh, it, that's going to be part of it. Oh. Alright, so well, I'll do it right here. Um, so if I just use the... Oh. Never mind. Oh, I have to do it in some amount of time. All right, I'll explain the spells again soon in a second. <laughs> Apparently, I got a time limit on this thing. Ooh, gazebo. Did somebody say wedding? What a day! What is this? Never mind. Rebellion. Did you see that? I don't think I've ever noticed how like fabulous he gets with it. I take it we can call that a success? We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my oh, notes. I was talking I about my name before. Are all of the Edward Taylor. Like this one? That's oh, all right. Not, it's not important anymore. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess is that each will also require mallow suit, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. Can I find one plant? I really or do must I have to buy one at Hogsmeade? Such a pleasure to meet you. And do be careful out here. Now, I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my new Die, lady. Rebellion. Pretty sweet, um... Thing. what I call it? Gazebo. <laughs> Almost said Gamora. What the hell just happened? What? Oh. I wish I watched that a little bit more. Look at Hogwarts. Oh. Young Slytherin. Pi, 3.14. For Professor Fink, Scrope can help you. And you can help. This is the first time I've ever heard of Scrope. No idea who Scrope is or why he's talking if you to don't me. Know it, you'll see it easy enough. And don't tell anyone what you're up to. Especially How am I even Sabrina. hearing him? <laughs> but why isn't that in front of me? They should have animated it in front of me. Alright, so if I just use the uh, right trigger, I can just shoot a normal spell, which is the spell stupefy for fans of Potter. Um, or if I hold it, if I hold in the right trigger and not just click it, uh, you see at the bottom right there, those, uh, things get the letters, A, X, Y, B, at the, uh, uh, down the bottom there. <laughs> and then I can press that corresponding button on the controller, uh, to do that spell. So the bottom one, A, which is the fire, I can do that. It starts a fire, uh, X is Accio, which is the summoning thing, which I don't know if there's anything here that I can summon towards me as an example. But it's meant to bring things towards you, like enemies, and then you can attack them closer. Uh, the top one there is Lumos. Lumos, or Lumos, as he says, which is the torch. The right one is um, Levioso. Not Wingardium Leviosa. It's Levioso. Um, Levioso. Which makes things levitate if you shoot it at an object. Oh, I wonder if I can... Nope. I can, can do that. Oh. Um, 
uh, just like a, a there's like Rebellion. the Revelio, which is like that little triangle Illuminati sort of symbol that's down there, just above the um, Accio. above Accio, and then you got the the grid. So this is all the spells you can learn, uh, and then if you want to um, switch out for what you have on the thing, you hold in the trigger, you change it out, and look now I can turn invisible, almost. Um, but, yeah, or Repairo, let's see if I can actually repair what I just destroyed. Oh my gosh, an example, oh. an example worked, <gasps> nice, that's what I'm talking about, baby. Oh, someone's in. Damn, those loading times. I'm assuming you teach me a spell. <laughs> Exampliosa. <laughs> uh, this is how you make a fire, Jeremy. Oh, yeah. And then you can roll through it like a crazy stuntman. Although it doesn't spread. Oh, let's collect some leech juice. Delicious. All right, Jeremy, you tuned in at, at the right time because we're going to um, You have a lighter. Yeah, a lighter works as well, I guess. For a muggle. We're heading uh, uh, towards um, Hogwarts. Oh, what's this place, Jeremy? What's this place? You know Harry Potter. What's this place? Oh, I'll make the sheep levitate. And I'll set it on fire. No, no, damn it. No, I won't. Die! Die! <laughs> it is Hagrid's. But seeing as it's 100 years before... Um, Harry Potter. This is just the caretaker's hut. So it's not necessarily Hagrid's hut. So there's no... No, Fang's not in here yet. But this is the uh, pumpkin patch where Buckbeak uh, is. And like in the third movie, they're hiding in the bushes here. And they're like, Buckbeak, get over here. Don't get your head chopped off. Good times. Oh! Hagrid's. Hagrid always was, always will be. Uh, Jeremy is allowed to say that. <laughs> I'm just going to throw that out there quickly. Jeremy's allowed to say that. <laughs> uh, do, do, do. What's this? Can I Accio it? <gasps> I can. Follow me, box. Can I destroy it? What's this for? Was this here before? Incendio. Oh, you can stay there. Another one! I don't remember that being there. Here's that rickety bridge. Oh, this is where Hermione punched Malfoy. Remember that? Classic scene. The rickety bridge. Uh, in the third movie, Lupin's talking to Harry along this bridge, and you can pause it at the right moment, and it looks like he has a um, pair of testicles and a penis on his head. Almost like the character has there, but it looks better in the movie. Didn't even realize until I said that you can say it. <laughs> oh, oh, here we go. We'll Revelio, whatever this Revelio. is. And it tells you about it. The Well of Four Beasts. Cool. You can pause that and uh, read that when you watch this on YouTube tomorrow. This is the uh, area where um, Professor Umbridge kicks out Madame Trelawney in the fifth movie. My grand uncle was the man who started using the saying for the land rights movement. Oh, that's pretty cool. I think, uh, unless that's not cool. It's good that he's. It's good. He seems like a good person. Let's let's say it like that. <laughs> Scrope. Oh, Jeremy, I don't know if you joined it in time, but Scrope is a house elf. He just um, tele telekinesized a message to my brain. Uh, and then he decided to leave a note somewhere instead of telepathically telling me it like he did before. Scrope knows uh, about that book you found. Is it missing something? Scrope does not believe it is safe to speak out in the open. Let's just telepath it to me again. Scrope has left another note across the bridge among the circle of rocks. I just literally came from that area. Back across the bridge we go. <laughs> Sorry, Hogwarts. We'll see you later. Oh, an owl. Ready? I'll, 
Let's see if I can Akio it. Damn it. Akio the owl. Yes. Oh well. There's the owlery. And over there in the distance is the Quidditch pitch. Oh. And Jeremy, can you see what that is down there? Dobby, yeah, Dobby is a house elf, correct? Uh, but this was... What was his name? Scrotum? Scrope. That's Hagrid's hut, but from the first and second movie, when it was right next to the castle, when, like, the car... You know how they crashed the car and it was able to drive to Hagrid's hut? It's like that. So, I guess, like, in Harry Potter lore, what they're saying is that there's two different Hagrid huts. Hagrid, Hagrid's huts. One down there and then one down uh, by the cabbage patch down that way. All right. Where's um, Scrotum's new note? There it is. Found it. No. Nope. other note. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm guessing he's going to make me uh, platform my way up there. I'm guessing this is going to be a mechanic in the game from now on. Almost there, head for the pumpkins, down from the stone circle, look inside one of them. I literally just came from down there. Pumpkins? Ah, I think I know just the place. Yeah, yeah. I think I know just the place, the place I just walked past two minutes ago. See, this is why Hermione was wrong with Spew. House elves don't need rights. This is not the right time to say that after. <laughs> There's that bloody sheep again. Bugger off. Do I have to attack things? Do I... Oh, here we go. This is how we're going to do it. Just destroy all the pumpkins. Um, anyone seen a note yet? <laughs> there it is. <laughs> The young Slytherin must be exceptionally curious by now. Meet Scrope at the water's edge by the broken docks. Down to the water's edge. Hmm. Oh, another message. So Reported. Be a trick. <laughs> Ooh. Hagrid's big hat. Oh, that was a big jump. Oh, that must mean the Whomping Willow should be like around here, right? It's not here because it's 100 years before it, or 80 years before it got planned. What's this? Could it be <gasps> a Merlin trial? It is a Merlin trial. I'm not doing it now. I've got to go and meet Scronag. Oops. No, I want Lumos. 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 Lumos Maxima. Lumos. Oh, look at these glowing things. Oh, what's this? Destroy it. I don't understand it. Destroy it. What is all this? Wow, so pretty. Lumos. Incendium. Oh. Made him red. Made him angry. You're one for my will. <laughs> Nice. There he is. It looks like uh, <laughs> one of my uni tutors from last year. <laughs> the name's Scrope. Scrope serves the head Scrope, master. Brian, same Been thing. Been in the Black family for years. Apologies for the abundance of notes. Scrope wanted to be looks sure like Brian uh, we saw What's down at the water with his dog. Walk past that time. Mentioned the book I found in the restricted section. Maybe I wasn't with Scrap you. I thought I was with you. In exchange for your help, but no one, I can't remember. Especially Maybe I wasn't with you. Maybe I was by myself. Know. Of course. What can I do for you? Oh, especially headmaster. Can I? We'll just go Happy with that one. To help. It's especially creature. If you can shed light David, you know creature. Scrope is grateful. Scrope's late mistress, Apollonia Black. May she rest in peace. Keep it PG, you filthy half <laughs> so over 50 years ago, before she died, Jeremy with the references. With Jeremy and David with references. Ripped from a book. Scrope suspects she took them to her private grotto. Private grotto? At the end, poor thing. 
Mistook Womp your willow in your private medicine. grotto. <laughs> Scrope tried to warn her. I'm sorry to hear that. But how do you benefit if I find the pages? Scrope believes that so there's a magical I book I had to get from the restricted section in the, the library. Scrope there's a, there's pages the missing from it. Apparently, Scrotum knows where they are. The so it's looking ago. like I'm going to have to hold up but Scrotum Scrope so we can find the magical pages. Wishes. Scrope would not dare ask a student for help. But when Scrope learned you were looking for those pages, Scrope thought you might also find the ring. And now I've just heard about a ring. Um, do, 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 do. I don't want to ask him any questions. I shall do it. Scrope is relieved. Scrope hoped the young Slytherin would be willing Jason to Jason should be host. He has a funny... Pin tight that. Tight pin that. Just down the coast. Pin Place that. Customised time. Uh, c can that just be permanently pinned? Scrope will wait right here for you. Best of luck finding your pages. Let's go until... Uh, we'll go manually unpinned or until the end of stream. Revelio. Any secrets over here, though, before we disappear? <gasps> Ooh! See, I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have seen that. I got seven quid, seven gold galleons. Although you don't ever, you don't ever deal with sickles or nuts. You can roll, you can jump, you can ugh, almost, almost three sixty, and you can swim as well. Ooh, ooh. I got a challenge at the moment. I have to dodge uh, t ten times. So I'm gonna probably just play with this guy for a bit and dodge him a few times to try and get um, that challenge done. Nice dodge. Go again. Haha, uh -huh, blocked you. Come on, you dirty rock. Dirty rock. <laughs> Frog is what I was meant to say, not rock. <laughs> Back her off. Try and tackle me again. Oh, didn't time that well. Woo! 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 I'm gonna throw a rock at you, you... Oh, that was your mate. Sorry. <laughs> How many more dodges do I need to do? Oh, oh. Oh, I'm going to take a potion. Ah! Another potion. I'm going to kill you. <laughs> I'm going to pick up his tongue. Ooh, magical. Come on, try and attack me again. No, physically. All right, never mind. I'll take your tongue. Hey, little bitch. <laughs> Jeremy. I said, hey, little bitch, and Casper went, huh? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? The? He brought mates. He brought his family along. All right, sweet. I did the uh, I did the quest. I dodged 10 times. So now I can kill these mofs. and co-host. I agree, but she doesn't want to do it for some reason. 
Patty! Patty! <laughs> well, Patty, what would you call it if you're not going to call it a little bitch? Patty, what um, Hogwarts house are you in? You probably know that. You probably know what your Patronus is. What's your Patronus? Muskrat. Cockroach. I need a um a flying spell or a broomstick. Hashtag Catherine's Catherine's Suki bum doesn't want to help make Jason host. That's a great. I would almost tag it, but I like your other one more still. Um, but uh, I I do like it. <laughs> I wish I could react. I wish I could just ha ha, um comments. Can you ha ha? Maybe you can. Maybe I'm just. Stupid. Going for a swim into a... Uh, oh, this is the private grotto. I remember. I paid slight attention. Come on, get out of the water. Come on, man. Uh, uh. Why would I need a piece of toast? I suppose you can with your goes. mouth and face on camera. Oh, right. I see what you're saying. Right. React. In real life. <laughs> no, I don't want to. What am I placing here? What is that? A pizza slice. What was that? <laughs> Jeremy, do you know where I got whatever that was from? And what this squid's going to do with it? Is that the giant squid from the lake? Now that's what I call a grotto. Ready for this magic? Look how dark it is in here. Ready, Patty? Patty, you're gonna witness some magic. Lumos. Look at that. Now I can see. Apollonia Black's journal. Don't know. I'm assuming that's um. Could it be? A relative a of Siri. <gasps> is this nearly headless Nick? No, he's completely headless. <laughs> Richard Jackdaw. Ah, the name's Richard Jackdaw. From I Assassin's Creed Black Flag. Like you, about a Jeremy. Ago. How in the world did you find this place? A house elf named Scrope sent me. Said I might find a black family ring here. Ah. A black family Sorry ring. Say I sold the ring Don't say anything. Ago. You're racist. Scrope. Still holds You're an absolute racist. Apollonia, you and Wally. Can't say I blame him. Can't trust her either of you. I stole all these treasures just to impress her. Alas, it was to no avail. I thought a secret map I pilfered from Peeves would pique her interest. Nearly it's headless. It's all connected. <laughs> what would I want with yellow? No, it wasn't connected at all. From a book. That's why he's not nearly headless. He not was just completely headless. Moment. Oh, I need to start listening to what he's saying. What would I want with yellow old pages torn from a book? Not my finest moment. Okay, well then hand them over. I must insist that you give them to me at once. They're not here. I thought if Apollonia wasn't interested in the map on the page, black flag. Perhaps it Keep up. To something that would I'm keeping up. Go. I'm keeping up. So, I followed the map. Courtney to what I um, had a baby. Chloe had a baby. Um, her uh, other daughter's you see father what next. Um, had a baby <laughs> with somebody else. Here. I'm keeping up. We're talking about the Kardashians, right? The <laughs> Zing. And I'll show you where to find the pages. Zing. <laughs> Got him. I'll see you at the forest. I suppose if that's the only way Don't to know what he said. those pages, I'll meet you at the forest. Man, it'd be great if I could I'm see sure Hogwarts during this. Still tucked in my waistcoat. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, they're yours for the taking. <gasps> We're going to go see his naked body. What else is in here, Rebellion. though? What can I take? Ooh! A treasure chest. Oh. Ooh. Okay. Uh, Lumos at a bridge with candles. And there'll be a thing and a house and trees. And a pillar? You gonna remember that? I don't know. Hmm, but I gotta... Oh, what's going on behind here? To be connected to the missing pages. Um, Jackdaw, what are you... What are you doing with this guy? Guy or girl? 
Why does he have a pair of sunglasses down in his willy? <gasps> Spin it. Where it lands is where we go. There is no land on that globe at all. What is that green thing? I don't know. Oh, sweet jump. All right. Back in the water we go. Actually, let's see if I can avoid it. Yes. Parkour master. Parkour master. Oh, nope, never mind. Well, at least it's date. It's like noon. How long was I in there? Yeah, big jump. Are we going going to the forest or something now? That's pretty. Look at this place. How come they never come here in the movies? I would just chill out here all the time. I'd, if I was Colin Creevy, look, you got a great photo. If you're Colin Creevy, bring your camera down here, chuck a wide lens on it, get down low, and you could get the. Waterfall right in the middle of that gap of the bridge and have the bridge over top. That's composition. Earth is flat, I agree. Yeah, Catherine said Jess should be here learning photography. Not studying an ancient book that should already be studied by now. No, go study your book. I'm not against people studying books. Hello, Scrope. <laughs> Thanks to you, I was able to enter Apollonia's Grotto. The toast was the key. Look at those next gen graphics on Scrotum's head. Jackal, oh, God. Who's agreed to lead me to the pages I've been looking for. Oh, that boy was never good enough for Apollonia. Oh, what of the Black Family Ring? I'm sorry to say that Jackdaw sold it long ago. Sad news indeed. Scrope shall need to think of another way to impress the headmaster. Well, Scrope takes Maybe some do a consolation dance. in knowing that the young Slytherin found what they. A dance could impress the headmaster. Thank you again. Maybe Scrope. not. You're a credit to Tango? Ourselves. Maybe not Flamenco? Have you heard of Natu? Natu? What is Natu? It's not racist, I'm singing. <laughs> I don't know what the words are. I'm just. I'm scatting. It's jazz. You're racist, Wally. You racist. Some of the things he says. Alright. Um, we have to... Oh, why is it locked? This is the map as well. If you want to... If you want to... Um, if you don't want map spoilies, look away for the next 10 seconds. Or until I say come back. So, you got Hogwarts. Oh, you're going to hear all the spoilies anyway. <laughs> And then you got Hogsmeade over here. There's the town Hogsmeade. And then you got all these other places you can go up here. Hub, Upper Hogsfield. Pit upon four. No idea. That, that's apparently the Forbidden Forest is out here. Out of Hogwarts, which is I don't know, crazy talk. Hogwarts Valley, which there is towns in, inside Hogwarts Valley. And it comes all the way down here. All the way down here, down to the Klagmar Coast. Apparently, Azkaban is also in this game. I've, I've seen um, footage of. That was more than 10 seconds, so I'm sorry if I spoiled uh, your life for you. Oh, I didn't even do what I was meant to be doing. I was trying to see what the mission was, where I had to go. Ugh. Tell you what, it's not... Um, it's just... It's not fun trying to navigate this map. It's, it's like GTA, Red Dead. Almost every other game has a much easier map to navigate. You've got to use both sticks on this and triggers to in order to try and navigate it. Um, you know what? We're going to do um, a quick tour of Hogwarts. If anyone wants anything in particular to look at, chuck it in the chat so I make sure that I show it. Like, if you want to see the Great Hall, I'm in Slytherin, so if you want to see the common room or anything like that, make sure you tell me. Um, Jeremy, if you want to see any of that, otherwise I, I might not show it in time. Just If I do another mission, it's probably going to go for too long. Uh, I want to be out of here by 9 o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> Not that I have anywhere to be. Like, I'm already... I'm at home. <laughs> All 
All right, back up these bloody stairs again. All right, here's the, um, we already saw the owlery before when we were on the bridge, but here's a um, an external. You, that's where we send the post. That's where Harry asked Cho Chang out, but she was like, "I'm already going with Cedric." This is the bridge where Cedric told Harry to put the egg on the water. Um, up here, you see that big old clock donging back and forth. You might remember. So this, like I said before, this is where um, the little pink lady kicked the uh, big-eyed lady out. Uh, but in the third movie, remember when they're going off to Hogsmeade, Harry comes out here and Profenigam, Profenigam, Professor McGonagall <laughs> is like, where's your form? And he goes, Professor, I just thought you would maybe sign it and let me go to Hogwarts. It's, I'm sorry, Potter, but it'll be inappropriate. Um, yes, yeah, so that's a big old the clock dong thing. I just realised there's little doors up there. Oh, well. Um... Now, I'm, I don't know how to navigate Hogwarts, so we're pretty much just going to run around. Chamber If Secrets. I was actually wondering, I'd, I feel like I saw like a whisper about Chamber of Secrets at some point. Um, but I can't remember if it was yes or no. Um, but I, I have been looking in bathrooms. I haven't found a bathroom that looks enough like it yet. I found a bathroom that was currently locked until I um, achieve a higher rank or progress further into the story. So that could possibly be it. Um, I just realised there's a painting of that trumpet right there. The French one. Bugle. What is it? i got no idea where I even am in relation to the rest of the castle. Any other suggestions, Jeremy? Because the Chamber of Secrets... Oh, here's a bathroom. Giant was the chest from first movie. What about more more sort of like public areas? <laughs> There's a cubicle. A cubicle. That looks almost like it, except that it's only half of it. But actually, I think this one here was the locked one. Yeah, out of order. But it was the girls' toilet in Chamber of Secrets, so it can't be that because that, that that's a that's a wizard's hat. And as we know, J.K. Rowling, you can only be a wizard to go in the wizard's toilet. No, let's not make it political. Don't make it political. Um, no idea what this place is, but it's there. There's a little bridge. There's the alley up there. Oh, the hell was that? What was that noise? Oh, people flying on broomsticks. That'll be me one day. Big bowl of fried chicken when let the feast begin. Well, let's see if there's any fried chicken. Um, where am I at the moment? Let's get rid of that thing, that quest. So it's not taking up my map. Actually, you know, while we're here, we might as well add a... Um, a drop point so I can find the Great Hall. <laughs> uh, which I think is in this area. Great Hall. Yes. Set waypoint. You can fast travel with the flu network. Um, which I know that's not in the books or movies. But it, it really does make life easier with some things. But I also do like just walking around. Cool little bridge here. Oh, frame rate. Frame rate. Next gen frame rates. Um, now we're in this area. <laughs> this is. Um, I don't know where this is. Oh! A collectible. Hell yeah. Oh! Look at this spiral staircase. Sorry, we're going to take a detour before we go to the other place. Is this the spiral staircase that Neville is crying on? Does it go up to divination? <gasps> it is going up to divination. Oh my gosh. Oh. Do they climb a ladder? In the book? Man, imagine carrying the books up here. I need a new monitor now. Monitor's not going to ch change frame rate. Why don't that make it more obvious? I don't know. Oh, hello, lady. I'm just going to search your chest behind you. That, not like that. <laughs> Where 
What is this thing? I want it. Rebellion. Oh, what? a magical letter. Well, not magical, but. Uh, under Professor Black's direction, is my honor as deputy minister of the position divination. Oh, she keeps from Matilda Weasley. Yeah, there's a couple of Weasleys in this game. Spin. All right, back on track. Back on track to the um, back to the leaky cauldron. No, what are we doing? Great hall. What a big like. This is just this is just the worst idea ever. I would not go up, and it's a safety hazard. You lose your balance up the top there, and you kick off, and you fall all the way back. Can I Incendium. put red flames in it? No. Yeah. This guy broke his coccyx when he fell off the, the ladder, and now he's just having a break. He's waiting for uh, Madame Promfrey to get up here. Uh. Madame Promf Promfrey to get up here promptly. What's on this level? A couple of little corridors. Oh, <gasps> this is where Voldemort and Harry fight. Remember in the last movie they fight on like wooden beams like this. Wow, crazy. Do 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 do. Like my blue gloves and my blue vest. Coming through. Oh, it has to load the door. Come on, console. You meant to be better than this. Sprint, sprint, sprint. So all these blue flames are uh, flu powder networks where you can um, fast travel to. Did I say blue flames? Green flames. This is the area in the fourth movie after Durmstrang leaves or after both schools leave. That was the librarian. Where'd you go? Oh, there. Um, and they say stuff. I can't remember what they say at the end. But I think like Ron jumps through that or something. Can't remember. This is nice. Let's have a quick little looky out. There's the greenhouses over there. What is that mysterious ticking noise? <laughs> oh my gosh, look at all these messages you have. Hang on. Keep up, Jason. You meant to be the host. Uh, Chamber of Secrets. Big bowl of fried chicken. We're getting there. Monitor them, monitor them. Spend money, spend money. Alright, here we go. Oh, Jesus, more stairs. Here we go, here we go. Ready? I don't want to go in. I'm too scared. Okay, let's do it. Hey, oh. it's me, Gareth. Do you have a moment? Gareth Weasley? No, I'll be back. Oh, That's, <laughs> I keep forgetting there's a, this little uh, middle room. What's that way? <gasps> oh. One sec, Jeremy, we'll be there, we'll be there. This is the staircase. Apparently. The one that moves and changes, but it doesn't... Oh! See that? See that? But I don't, I don't understand why it does that, because it seems to just reappear back to its same position. 360! Ah, damn it. 360! Alright. Oh, one more. Oh, there's Peeves! Piss off, peeps. Incendio. Alright. Ba 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 here we go. <gasps> Look at all this food. Which one's Slytherin table? Slytherin over here. What do we got? What do we got? Oh god, the li light's bright. What's the roof look like? Doesn't does not look like the sky at all. Uh some Pasties, ribs, a big chicken thingy. Oh, is that... Jeremy, is that fried chicken on that round plate? On that one there? Accio. Accio chicken. Man, look at that chicken grab. Look at the food graphics when you like start changing the camera angle. Absolute dog shit. Oh, there's a bit of chicken on that plate there. Paid a thousand dollars to play this game. Look at that corn. <laughs> Is that chicken? Oh, I need to scroll back down to the bottom. There you go, Jeremy. That's definitely chicken there. That's definitely chicken. Make sure it's cooked. 
Nice. Is that going to disappear? Is that going to stay there now? Um, cool. Well, I'm going to leave it there because it's almost 9 o'clock. We did a... Uh, actually, we didn't do any missions. We spoke to the chick. Oh, we killed some people. And we spoke to a ghost. Nah. There's a big fire pit there. Uh, it's just not as giant and delicious looking as the first movie. No, it's not. In the first, maybe because they were smaller, the perspective looked big. Is this door not even centered? Hang on, hang on a sec. Oh no, it's just a, it's just the over-the-shoulder camera is not centered. Are the dome destroying students coming down there? Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's the ooh, 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 ooh. Oh. Oh. And then the Bobatons coming down. Hang on. Can we get back up here? And they come down with their big old booties. Which the actor the actors were older older than eighteen, must have been. Uh and the la 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 Lumos. Ah, that's the best I got. La 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 ah. And then they start like jogging lightly, which distracts Ron. So yeah, make it. It's not weird if I say it distracts Ron and I leave out my own personal thoughts. That makes it less weird. Also, it's not weird because I was a I was a kid when I watched it. Um, but yeah, that's Harry Potter. That's the um. Well, that's that's not Harry Potter. That's some of Hogwarts legacy. A very brief look. Uh, might play some more later. Might end up doing a video in it. I don't know. Hopefully, I get a broomstick soon. If I don't get a broomstick, I'm gonna be bloody. Expelliarmus someone uh, But yeah Thanks so much For tuning in Thanks Jeremy For taking up The whole chat I don't know If anyone else Is in the chat At all at the moment If David's still here If Paddy's still here Or Kane Kane Posted one thing 40 out 40 blah, 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 Words Posted one thing Thanks That's alright You can get a tour Anytime you want Jeremy We have to do a tour Of Red Dead Kane wants me to do Red Dead So we can do a, um, next time you have a Monday night off, which if I knew you had tonight off, I would have done something with you. Maybe you're just staying up late. Who knows? Anyway. Thanks very much for watching, everybody else. <laughs> if you're watching this on YouTube, make sure you do subscribe. If you are watching this on Twitch, um, after the date, uh, after, after the date, after now, you're just watching it on Twitch, uh, make sure you do follow. I need a few more followers. Um, and then I can get affiliated, which means something. You just finished your walk this late? Oh, well, at least you're walking. We used to, we walked for two weeks with a dog, and then uh, we walked one time since that. No, don't want to go now, no. Uh, I'll only walk if Jeremy walks. Jeremy, we should walk across the Red Dead map. That'll only take three hours. Uh, yeah, anyway. I'll see you later, Jeremy. Maybe we'll play a game later in the week. Uh, otherwise, goodbye! <laughs> Do you want to say bye, Kevin? I don't know if you heard that. Hang on. Goodbye! Uh, idiot. <laughs> uh, stream finished.